warmer out there as you head out the door. Uh, the temperatures eventually should reach the low 70s, which is a little bit above normal for this time of year. 702 is your sunset time this evening, and we do have that chance for a few rain showers in the southern part of the state for today, tonight, and into tomorrow. Uh, could a couple of those showers sneak up uh, farther north into our area? It's possible, but I think the main thing you'll notice tomorrow morning is some fog around the area that'll burn off, and we'll see some sun in the afternoon before, again, maybe a little shower th storm sneaking up into the area uh, Wednesday evening or Wednesday night. But other than that, it really looks pretty quiet. Uh, maybe a, a bit of fog early Thursday again before we see more sun. And Thursday's the day that's going to be the warmest, and here's some of that action out to the west that eventually will likely reach us uh, late this week. So 71 for today, variable clouds, maybe a sprinkle in the southern part of the area. And then tonight could see a little fog developing with lows in the 50s and tomorrow might be a little foggy early, but eventually we should see some sun out there with a high of 79. So really warming up with the south southeast wind uh, and it will stay warm for Thursday and Friday. Warm for this time of year anyway, 81 on Thursday, 79 on Friday and Friday. The rain chance starts to increase, not a guarantee that we're going to see rain on Friday or Saturday, but at least a 30 percent chance. That chance is going to increase to 40 percent on Sunday and Monday as the temperatures cool down a bit and fall is the time for sedum. And here we have some bumblebees enjoying some of that great nectar.